I'm Doug, we're in Hoobastank, we're talking about dream tours here, and immediately you think like, well who do you want to tour with, you know, or, or who would you want to see, but I, when, when you brought up dream tours, what I thought is like, what kind of tour would I want to be on, you know, um, and, and, and I don't, I don't even think it, the, like the bands that are on the tour musically matter, as long as they're just all super cool, <laughs> and the atmosphere, um, backstage, before shows and after shows has to be like a summer camp. Everybody's got to be like tight and eating food with each other and, and, and seeing movies on off days together and, and, and shit like that is what I consider like a dream tour where like where everybody just becomes really close friends and almost like the shows themselves become secondary to because the shows themselves only last for our sets are only like you know 40 minutes an hour at most but the, the other 23 hours of the day we're spending time with these other bands, you know, uh, and I'm trying to think of like, we've had that experience before in the past um, with lots of bands, but um, and they are always the most enjoyable tours. Yeah, and and I don't remember, I don't go, I I don't remember like uh, the most enjoyable aspects of those tours being like I sat on the stage and I, I was a huge fan of this band and I watched the play. Granted, there are there is that, but it's always like how much time we spent off stage, you know, hanging out and talking and having these good memories. Um, so I think regardless of, uh, of who it is, if you could throw uh, together a tour, put us on it, where everybody just gels, and if you could throw in great shows also, obviously, uh, well attended great shows, then that's perfect, it doesn't even matter. I almost, it almost is preferable that you don't know the people going in and you like discover how good they are musically and as people. I think those are the dream tours, I think. Where you walk away going, I wasn't a fan of you know, XYZ, and now I love that band. They're so good, and even more is they're, they're awesome people. That's the kind of shit I look forward to.